And it's just the same with our bodies. Health depends on proper food, and proper food depends on vitamins. The four basic vitamins are A, B, C, and D. Take away any one of them, and our health comes tumbling down. So, for the sake of our health, we all should know a little about each vitamin. Vitamin A is for the eyes, especially for night vision. Imagine the eye strain of having to fly this night fighter in the dark. That's why we give our night fighter pilots food which has plenty of vitamin A, such as carrots. And these small capsules which contain a special ration of halibut liver oil. But vitamin A is just as necessary for you, the lorry driver, and you, the miner. And to all of us, particularly those who suffer from night blindness, the answer is... Carrots! In peacetime, we obtained half our vitamin A from dairy produce. These are now rationed. But we can make up for that by eating more tomatoes, carrots, and green leafy vegetables. Vitamin A is not only for the eyes. It is necessary for growth. That is why children need it. And for them, we have special supplies of cod liver oil. For the eyes and growth, vitamin A. Vitamin B is for all physical and nervous energy, and digestion. For instance, you can't do this kind of thing unless you have built up a good reserve of physical energy and strong nerves with vitamin B. Vitamin B is absolutely necessary for everyone who does heavy work. If you have to sit at a desk all day, it is even more necessary for your digestion. And children, who are continually using up their physical and nervous energy, they need it. Our best wartime sources of vitamin B are the National Wheatmeal Loaf, Oatmeal and all the dried peas and beans. For energy, vitamin B. Vitamin C builds up our vitality, especially in winter. In the old days, Sailors on long voyages often suffered from a disease called scurvy. This was found to be caused by the lack of fresh fruit and vegetables. So in 1795, the Admiralty issued a standing order saying that every man aboard ship must have an ounce of lemon juice per day. We now know that fresh fruit and vegetable juice are valuable because they are rich in vitamin C. We cannot produce or import enough fruit in wartime but we are growing more green vegetables to take their place. Some of these are richer in vitamin C than fruit. Vegetables which are rich in vitamin C are all the cabbage family, such as cauliflower, broccoli, also spinach, mustard and cress, and watercress. Through the campaign to grow more vegetables, the nation is now self-supporting in vitamin C. And for the very young, we have our home supplies of tinned blackcurrant puree, blackcurrant syrup, and concentrated orange juice from America. Vitamin C can be lost in bad cooking.
And this is what happens if you cook your green vegetables too long or in too much water. You will get more value out of green vegetables if you eat them raw as part of your salads. Remember, your garden will provide you with green vegetables all the year round. So dig for vegetables and vitamin C. For fitness, vitamin C. Vitamin D is for good teeth and strong bones. Our best wartime sources of vitamin D are margarine and all the fatty fish, such as herrings and sardines, when you can get them. And for the children, the special rations of cod liver oil and milk, both containing vitamins A and D. Margarine also contains vitamins A and D. We are increasing the quantity of vitamin D in the manufacture of margarine. By this process, our wartime margarine contains twice the amount of vitamin D that you can get from the best summer butter. Remember that an ounce of margarine contains as much vitamin D as one egg. For teeth and bones, vitamin D.